crafty friends it's tina the scrap and rabbit and i'm back again today for day three of the jaded blossom a september 2017 release and we have two stamp sets to share today i just think that they are so cute i hope you like them this first one here is called magical halloween and you get this really fun unicorn sugar skull <laughs> and then look at these sentiments that you get so the first one is wishing you a magical halloween no bones about it you're the best break a leg you get a little candy there that says bon appetit you have a sentiment here unicorn horns bone chilling treats i love every bone in your body bone a big bone appetit and bag of bones I so wish I was able to find some bone candy for my project, but they're just now trickling out with all the Halloween stuff in my town, so hopefully I'll be able to find some really cute stuff soon. This second stamp set is called Perfect Halloween, and you get the kitty and the doggy sugar skulls. Aren't they just so sweet? I think they're adorable. So now look at these fun sentiments. You get meow Halloween or Halloween, wishing you a perfect Halloween. You also have happy there, so you could put happy Meowloween or happy Halloween. This one here says meow, meow trick or treat. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but treats will make my tail wag. And then you get the woof woof happy Halloween. So super duper cute, especially for those of you who like dogs and cats. That's a fun set to work with. So let me go ahead and share with you what I made. I made this treat box using the magical Halloween set and I colored up this little unicorn and I added lots of sparkle. I hope that you guys can see that so that it looks extra magical. And let me show you what I used to make this treat box. The box itself is from the Jaded Blossom Gable Box die, which I absolutely love. This die is gonna be getting lots of use from me. And so that's what I used for this. And I used some really cool paper. I think I have that handy, let me grab it. This is the paper that I used, and it is the Die Cuts with a View, the Stardust Stack. And I bought this a few months ago, and I did get it on sale, and it, you have really cool star-themed galaxy type of papers here. And they're really sparkly, and they have foil, and it's just a really fun stack. And I think that... I did get it, I think, when they were like 50% off or something. So another great stack from Die Cuts with a View, and that's the paper that I used for my box. I thought it fit so well. Let me zoom back in. And then for this cloud, I cut this little cloud out of vellum, and that cloud is from the Jaded Blossom Spring Dice 2 set. You get three different clouds in this set, and I used that big one. I fit, thought it fit perfectly, and the unicorn sits on there. It's just the perfect size. Now for the sentiment, I used this one right here, the wishing, oops, I'm sorry, wishing you a magical Halloween right there. And then the label, I don't know if you can see that, but this paper here is holographic paper, and it's really sparkly and cool. For the label, I used the Jaded Blossom label shape dies. And I used this one, which one did I use? This one right here. And I cut out the smaller piece twice, and then I used the smaller piece to outline it by slicing it in half and then topping it instead of using the bigger panel right there because it does come with a layer, but I wanted a smaller layer, so that's why I did it this way. I embellished with these adorable little rhinestone stars, and I think that they turned out cute. And then I added some sparkly ribbon. And so there you go, there's my cool little unicorn sugar school box. So that is my project share for today. I wanna to thank you so much for stopping by and visiting my channel. We have two more days of reveals and tomorrow we have a one stamp set to share. So I hope to see you back then. 
please leave me a comment. I hope you have a wonderful day and happy crafting everyone. Bye-bye.